Hello and welcome to this quick tips video which is about having snap without using snap. So this is about constraining the direction of parts that you move around. So on screen I've got a pretty typical example where I've got a vocal part which isn't snapped or cut to anything remotely grid-like. So moving it can be a little difficult. So all I want to do is I want to move it from this main vocal track onto a vocal FX track where it will have different audio on it, etc. I'm going to start playing around with it. You will see if I try to move this, even if I'm careful, you can see the offset to the top right of the cursor where it says zero, 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 zero. And even if I'm careful, I've got to be really, really picky to get this at exactly the right place. So there I've managed to move it successfully. It's not always that easy, particularly if you've got a not great mouse. However, there is a way around this. Of course there is. That's why this video is here. And it's to hold down the command key on Mac, the control key on Windows. And as you drag it, providing you don't go crazy with the movement, you'll see I've managed to successfully do that without any trouble. If I move the mouse sideways, you'll see once I go too far, it will start moving. But initially, we've got this sort of temporary snap zone. That makes it much easier to do that. So just holding down control or command while you move parts from one track to another will make life much, much easier. As ever, hope you found that useful and we'll see you again soon for more Music Tech Tuition.